Well, good morning and happy Thursday and welcome to the Rebel Express Show. Today is May 7th and it is our 39th day of school closure and the home edition of the Rebel Express Show. I'm Chris Capaletti. I'm the Athletic Director, PD Guy Tech Guy for Cuba Rushford. Uh, it is, you can reach me on my Twitter, email, cell phone, yell, make sure we're social distancing. All right, let's get into the show. Good morning, everyone. School is closed through the end of school physically, but we are virtual teaching into June, so stay tuned for that end date. Um, I believe um, mid-June, end of June, something like that. All right, happy birthday! <laughs> happy birthday to Kaylee Finnamore. Happy birthday, Kaylee. I just saw a tweet from Miss Ralston that wishing you a happy birthday, so absolutely. Get out there and enjoy the day. The sun is out. Get out there. Mr. Jordan is back with Name That Animal. Boop. All right, I love it. Beep. Uh, Very cool. What is that thing? Ah, we'll have to find out at the end of the show. All right, it is day four of our mental health conditions. I'm sorry, it is our, let's say it right, Mr. Capaletti. It is day four of our NISFA Mental Health Awareness Week to raise awareness for mental health and breaking the stigma associated with uh, mental illness. All right, quote from Dwayne The Rock Johnson. You've probably seen a movie or two of his. The Rock, quote, I found that with depression, one of the most important things you can realize is that you are not alone. You're not the first to go through it. And The Rock says, quote, I wish I had someone at that time who could just pull me aside and say, hey, it's going to be okay. And thank you. That's a great, great quote by one of my favorite WWE wrestlers, movie stars, um, TV actors, you know. So it's not just some person who no one knows. It's the most popular people the people we've never heard of, it's, hey, it is going to be okay. Reach out to someone to help. We have virtual office hours with Dr. Lefevre and Mrs. Taylor on Mondays and Wednesdays. We always provide the uh, numbers to the Office of Mental Health and the crisis uh, hotline numbers. Reach out to friends, to family. Uh, a lot of people are here for you. All right. Here's a few words from our coaches. Roll the tape. We're getting ready to start week three of virtual online teaching and we just wanted to reach out to all you athletes and make sure you guys are staying positive. We miss you. We're thinking of you and every chance you get, keep working on your craft. Keep practicing. Do what you can to make yourself better both academically and, and athletically. Go Rebels. Go on, go on! Hey ladies, we're missing you. Hoping we can get back out here soon. Stay safe, keep active. Hey, we redid the dugout for you. We're here, ready to go. Hopefully next year we can be out here. Well, thank you, Mary and Nick. Those are great words. Um, really appreciate you guys taking the time to film a couple of words for you. Man, nice day like this with the sun's out. I miss sports every day. Miss it a little more when that sun is shining. Let me tell you. Athletic award night. So obviously we cannot have a physical sports award night. So we are planning. If you were planning, I'll probably give a lot of more details next week. But give me if you're like, what's going on? Give me a call. Love to hear from you. I love talking about. Love to talk about what we're thinking of. But seniors, your senior banners from the fall and the winter, you're getting those. All right. So. We have some uh, nice things this year, okay? All right, tweet of the day. <laughs> Here we go. Thank you at Mom Three Softball Morning Burpees. If you haven't seen this on Twitter, uh, she's doing burpees. It's a video uh, that's real tough, okay? And thank you, Mr. Tompkins. Bravo, Kate. All state in two sports. Yeah, if you missed this, Chris Brooks tweeted yesterday that Kate Howe, a senior at Cuba Rushford, is now all state in basketball also. Whoa. Whoa. Kate, you're awesome. All right, and thank you, CRCS sixth grade team. Mental health conditions are more common than you think. Join NISFA, Mental Health Awareness Week, to raise awareness for mental health. Hashtag breaking the stigma. And you can see we have some great... Uh, um, Pictures there, one in five, 
youth and young adults live with mental health conditions, okay? Um, I can't tell you how important this is to address this. Don't ignore it. Talk to people. Very, very important. All right, and thank you, Mr. Beck, for today's precept. Every accomplishment starts with the decision to try, right? The decision to try. Effort. You know me. I'm an effort guy. Put a little effort in. Go a long ways. All right, and thank you, Cuba Russian Ag Program. There's a time to change for this week's future fo There's a time change for this week's future focus. Uh, Friday speaker. It will be 11 instead of 10. Contact Mrs. Santangelo for the Zoom link. Very cool. Uh, Anna Harris, U.S. Fish and Wildlife. Man, that's super cool. Thank you, Mrs. Santangelo, for always putting these together. All right, and thank you, CRCS Hakuna Matata. In a slump these days, what's your go-to mood buster? I'm going to tell you right now. It works. Two songs, upbeat, real loud. Usually in my Jeep, it takes two. The first song, it's like, okay, I can get out of this. You know, I'm feeling down in the dumps. That By the end of that second song, all right, I'm back. I'm ready to turn, turn, the, uh, turn the switch. Let's make it a big day. Good day. A little over the top right there. Arm wrestling movie. No? Okay. But, all right, so we'll keep the hat on backwards. We'll finish the show. All right, thank you, Ms. Ralston, my favorite My CRCS Sweet of the Day. Uh, here's a word. Here's a word problem. I currently have four humans, a dog, seven chicks, and this very cute baby goat named Lavander living in my house. How many legs? How many mammal legs are there? Wow, that is a math problem. That goats are so darn cute. All right, and thank you, Brittany D. Honest, Honesty Wednesday. Sometimes you just got to take a break. Brittany, I amen, sister. I'm with you. We're gonna get some McDonald's and we're gonna watch a bunch of TV. Okay. Now we don't want to do that too much, but amen. All right, I believe that. Sometimes you just got to do it. And thank you, Mr. Morris. Mr. Morris sent us these pictures of the Farmersville Fire Department. He put a MiFi there, so that's a free Wi-Fi there. And now at the Black Creek Town Hall, uh, that other picture, the gray building, that's in Black Creek. So thank you, Mr. Morris. That's Mr. Morris's bike, huh? That's pretty awesome. So thanks, man. Appreciate it. All right. <laughs> Tomorrow, seniors, it is cap and gown picture day. Please arrive at your time, okay? Please arrive when you're supposed to be there. Um, you have to wear a mask. If you don't have a mask, we will provide one for you. You're going to come in. You're going to get your picture. You're going to get your cap and gown. You're going to go to the stage. You're going to take your mask off because no one will be around. Take your mask off. You're going to walk across the stage. You can take. I'll be in front of the stage on a little like lift. And you'll take your picture. And then you'll leave. Give your uh, gown to Miss Scheller, you can keep your cap if you want to decorate it, and then you gotta go. But it's a big day. I really hope we see all the seniors. I'm, I'm really pumped. I want to see all the seniors. That's for sure. All right. Let's not forget lunch every day, 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. Absolutely. Every day we do the COVID hotline, the Allegheny County Crisis Hotline, the Cattaraugus County Hotline, and the Office of Mental Health. These numbers are here for you for your, yourself, a loved one, a friend, uh, someone's going through a tough time, help them out. All right, go Yankees. Bang, I haven't heard a word from Major League Baseball. I wonder if we're going to see any baseball this year. Uh, math game of the day, www.coolmathgames.com. Today's math game of the day is Tale of the Dragon. Ooh. I think I'm going to start a new book about dragons. I like dragons. Dragons are cool. Um, you know, dragons are real. We could have a pet dragon. Okay. All right, that's fun. All right, and that animal boop, at the beginning boop, was a Himalayan tar from New Zealand. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. T A H R, a Himalayan tar. All right, very cool. And happy Thursday, everybody. I want everyone to get out, get a little sunshine, a little vitamin D on the palms of your hands. Very important. And we'll see you right here tomorrow on the Rebel Express show. Stay classy, everybody.